Today we are going to do the infamous wheel pose, which is one of my favorite poses that I've practiced since I was like six years old. So for wheel, we're going to set ourselves up in a nice bridge position. So go ahead and lay flat on your back. Lay down flat on your back, bend your knees, open your feet out about hip width distance apart. And then from here, go ahead and take your hands, place your palms down, and have your fingertips facing your shoulders, right? So instead of your fingertips facing the back, you want your fingertips to face your shoulders. From here, you're going to lift your hips up as if you're going into a regular bridge pose, and then push your feet down press into your hands lift your upper body up and you are in your wheel pose slowly go ahead and begin to move your feet a little bit back closer to you if you can keep the opening and expansion of your heart the entire time now to come out of your wheel pose you want to just gently lower back down the way you came up release your arms down by your side roll out your wrists and then you have finished your infamous wheel pose. Key things to remember, you're basically setting yourself up as if you're going into a bridge. You want your palms to be flatly placed on your mat. Your fingers are facing your shoulders. Make sure that you are squeezing your glutes as much as possible the entire time as you lift up. Keep your heart center open. This is a nice heart and throat center opener. So there we have it, our wheel pose. Try it. Let me know how it goes in the comment section below, and we'll meet back for our next step-by-step. -step. 